everyone, Heather here. So do you ever realize that when it comes to life and things such as nursing school that people just react differently and they have their own perception of what nursing school is like? Some people think that nursing school is crazy hard. Some people think, oh, you know, it's not as bad as I thought it would be. And some seem to have no problem at all. And we don't like those people very much, do we? I have this friend in nursing school and it seemed like she got A's on most of her tests and quizzes without a lot of effort. And then she'd tell me, oh, I barely studied. Now, I don't really know how true that is, but I was pissed and a little jealous because I actually have to study to get good grades on my tests and quizzes. Darn it. Now, I've always said that nursing school wasn't as bad as I thought it would be, and I'm sticking to it. No, it's not easy, but it's not the worst thing in the world either. Personally, I think being a parent is much harder than nursing school. But everybody's experience is different. It's like the way our body reacts to allergies. You know, some people have really bad environmental allergies. Some people are allergic to peanuts and bee stings, and some, hey, they don't have allergies at all. So, in relation to nursing school, some people are gonna think it's the worst thing ever and decide they don't wanna be a nurse anymore. Others will think, yeah, this is challenging, but it's doable. And then, there are others who are just gonna get A's with not as much effort as others. People's stress levels and the way they react to things are gonna be different. Like, for example, road rage. Why people get upset over other people's driving I'll just never understand. I've worked with some nurses who appear to be so stressed out that they don't even have time to help you co-sign insulin. And then there are others who will like drop anything to help you out with something. I always consider myself pretty laid back, but I think I actually found a nurse who's more laid back than myself, hard to believe. But one day I was like running around, probably giving meds because that's what I do all day. And he was just sitting there like, I don't know what he was doing. and. I was like, did you even see your patients today? <laughs> Sorry, I'm just acting out of jealousy. No, but it was kind of funny because I was thinking, man, he just must have everything under control. But there's one thing that will get me every time. And there's only one thing, and that's packing. I hate packing. My stress levels, and I'm pretty sure my blood pressure goes up during this time. It's so hard for me to pick and choose what I want to pack into a carry-on, which by the way is never big enough, right ladies? And packing a suitcase that can't weigh more than 50 pounds, come on, that's an all-day project for me. Sometimes my suitcase will be 54 pounds, and I'll be like, okay, Heather, think. What can I do without? Think, Heather. Only pack the items that you need and love the most. Well, I might decide to wear the shirt that I haven't worn in three years. I better take that just in case. And I definitely need all 10 pairs of jeans, because one day I might decide to wear ripped jeans, skinny jeans, black, white, dark, light blue. Yep, I need them all. Even though I only wear a third of what I pack most of the time, I need it all just in case. So now you see my dilemma. But you know, ice cream or brownies usually helps out with that. To some people, packing's not an issue. They can pack a bag in 15 minutes. I'll try not to be a hater on that one. Like packing for some people, nursing school will have a different effect on everyone and how they cope with the stress will be different too. So when you create your nursing experience, try and make it the best nursing journey possible and don't just go off of what somebody else says about it. Well guys, thanks for watching. Talk to you soon, okay? Bye.